Hi, this is Random Guy 818, and you know the Transformers video of you of Transformers of Roger the Fallen. Chromio. She is a deluxe class figure, and she is the motorcycle, a blue motorcycle. And it has the Cybertronic symbols all over it. She does have a silver Autobot symbol. Really cool. And she is blue, like her wheels are blue too, I mean. That's what I'm about to say. And she does have her motorcycle stand. You could take it off. And, you know, she does drive freely. Really cool. I really like her. Really fun to transform. And this stand does become a, like, a attack. Vehicle attack thing. Like, I don't know, stand maybe, I guess you could say, vehicle attack weapons on her motorcycle mode, which is pretty cool. So you put it like that, and then she has her blaster and her Gatling gun. Yeah, that's pretty neat. You can just take that off for now. Just like that. So yeah, on to transformation. Oh, by the way, when I first saw her, for some reason I thought this would be the head. Like, turn around or something, when I first saw her pi pictures of her. But it isn't, it's just a regular, you know, steering thing. So, what you want to do is, for a transformation, you just want to pull this part up. So, um, pull out the tank pieces. And then you're gonna pull out her arm, untab that, and then pull this part of the arm out, and then separate the chest piece, and then you're gonna start seeing her head already. And take out this part of the chest piece, pull it out, rotate it like that. Do the same thing on the other side, pull out, rotate. Then you could already pull out her head, just go and pull her out. Rotate it. Then after you do that, you could just come, um, push in her torso, torso together. You could already see her body taking shape. Then what you want to do is pull this in, and then pull this in like that. So you have her bottom wheel. And then pull this around. Rotate it around, I should say, not pull. And then push this in together, push your handlebars in together. And the handlebars are soft rubbery plastic, so be careful with them. And then push in this license plate thing over here. And then pull out, and she does have that Mech Alive gimmick. I just pull it out. And then push the plating around. Rotate it around. Rotate the plating on the other side as well. And then you can see her hand, and this is pretty much her robot mode. Really cool. And she does stand up using her stand. There's those that's just gonna push in right there. Like, like so. Then the And this is pretty much her in the robot mode. Nothing that much to her. She does have the big cannon arm. That's kind of a drawback. Really skinny. Really kind of tall. Not too tall. Her face is pretty detailed and really nice. But very, very floppy, I guess you could say. You know. Loose. Very loose. And then... So that's pretty much her face. She does have the blue eyes. There is a lighting cone in the back here, but I don't really know if the light goes in because her eyes are painted. Maybe around her eyes they light up. Because it's kind of looking like it lights up. And her wheels could move. 
I'll just keep her in the sand. Both wheels don't move. And she does have the shoulder plates and the arm plates, and that's pretty much it. She does have the firing missile. There's a button right here, and she fires her missile. Just like that. And her, and her missile is clear. And she does have this combiner piece in the back here, where the stand is. You just pull it out. This has nothing to do with the transformation. I am thinking that it will combine with RC and the other uh, motorcycle sister. I don't rem really remember her name. But yeah, I think that's for the com combination. And yeah, that's pretty much her. Really cool, really skinny, really tall. And yeah, that's that's it. Please rate, comment, and subscribe. Thank you.